Developing right now at 10 o'clock, an Oklahoma family fears their missing son may be involved in a robbery that turned deadly near Dallas today. Two men are dead, but at this hour, authorities have not said if one of them is 17-year-old Kenneth Chaffin. Authorities say he was on the run after stealing an arsenal of guns and a couple thousand rounds of ammo from his parents. What we do know tonight is that the boy's truck was at the house where the robbery and shooting happened. Two News reporter Sarah Goldenberg was the only local reporter to talk to his family in Pottawatomie County. She's live in the newsroom tonight with the very latest on this developing story. Sarah. Marla, Roland Chaffin is still waiting to hear whether his son is alive. He reported the weapons missing himself. Uh, just kind of Roland just Chaffin saying, can't shake the shock. Uh, we're just awaiting game to find out if this was my son or not. Monday night, he says his daughter found the house ransacked. Nine handguns, six rifles, and two shotguns missing. Not to mention up to 2,000 rounds of ammunition, medication, and Roland's pickup truck all gone. His 17 year old son, Kenneth, nowhere to be found. We weren't sure until, you know, you put all the stuff together. His, the truck's gone, he's gone. Authorities found those weapons here in Ellis County, Texas, just south of Dallas. Investigators say a homeowner shot one of two robbers on his property, but it appears both men died from self inflicted gunshot wounds. One of them found dead inside Chaffin's pickup truck. Back in Oklahoma, the Pottawatomie Sheriff's Office worried from the start that Kenneth's disappearance would become dangerous. He was concerned to us with that much, many weapons and that much ammo. We did not know what his mindset was. Roland says why Kenneth had run away a few times he... before. You know, why he left, we don't have a clue right now because, I mean, we'll probably never know. Uh, other than, you know, uh, Kenneth's always bucked my rules. Right now, they're waiting for answers. We're wanting to know, you know, is it, is it our son? And uh, just praying that it ain't. Again, the robbery suspects have not been identified yet. Live in the newsroom, Sarah Goldenberg, 2 News, works for you.